nothing. I'm meeting Jack here. Oh, you're, uh, you're still seeing him. And, and things are better than ever. Oh, even though he, uh, punched out his brother and landed himself in jail? Come on, that's all over. He is out of jail, and, and we are even closer than we were. Close as in close, close? Well, we're getting there. Soon, I bet. Livy, don't you think you're moving a little bit fast on this? Maybe. I, I just, I don't care anymore. Oh, no, wait. I do not want to hear that. <laughs> what? My life has been in, like, this holding pattern, and I'm tired of it. I just want to move on now. Then you're really sure about this? You think Jack's really it? Oh, come on. It feels so right. How can that be wrong? I used Livy. I used her to get in with you. That's the truth. That's why I came to Portugal's. Livy will hate him when she hears this. And you want that? I want her. And since she knows your partner, I... Yeah, Danny explained. That's why you wanted me. But I can't guarantee I'll deliver her to you. From what Denny tells me, she's pretty hot for your brother. Hey, just let me worry about that. Your job is to set her up. Does this Livy have a buddy? You know, a good girlfriend? Like the way you think. Hey, sounds a little rough. Yo, what's up, boy? What's up, bro? How you doing? Hey, good to see you out of cuffs. Yeah, you're not kidding. Got to know the cops a little too well around here. But yeah. that's going to change. Oh, wait. Let me guess. Libby. Yeah, Libby. Libby. Yeah. Yeah. I'm supposed to meet her here, but I've got a minute. I can take a look at your bike if you want me to. Yeah, um, actually, Allison's got a corner there. So I think we got a little bit more than a minute, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So uh, when'd you get your bike fixed, bro? Oh, last night. Why don't, why don't you ever get one of some of those turbo chargers? Oh, come on, that doesn't work, man. This thing is way too old, man, you know? Uh, I used to have one, man. I can modify it for you if you want me to. <laughs> have you ever even thought about getting hits with a garage? Uh, I mean, come on, you got the experience. Come on. Yeah, I've got the record, too. Bosses don't actually like that. Don't I know? You'll find something, bro. Well, you will, too, man. Yeah, I've got to if I'm going to stay here in Port Charles. My dad walked in on us together on the bed. Oh, no. I know. No, but it was totally cool. He was cool about it. I couldn't believe it. Well, wait until he figures out that he's got a record. Look, Allison, I know you don't like Jack. No, Livy, it's not that. It's... Come on, you've been trying to get me away from him since the minute I got here. I just, I, I don't want him to hurt you, that's all. I like Jamal hurt you? No, he never hurt me. But that's what everybody thought was going to happen, right? OK, right? I get it. I see where you're going with this. Then don't be so worried about me. Look, I hope that you're right about Jack. I really do. Yeah, well, so do I. Because I think that maybe I'm falling in love with him. OK, what can I get you? Uh, just bring me something on tap. Oh, well, don't you want something to eat? I'd rather drink after a day like today. Oh, it's that bad, huh? I know this kind of stuff happens to PIs all the time, but it's never happened to me. Oh, you're a detective? Yeah. I just had a client who stiffed me for all the work I did for him, too. I dug up a lot of good dirt. Mm. But doctors, they're the worst. And your client's a doctor? Yeah, some big way over General Hospital. I got the goods on his kid brother for him, right? Mm -hmm. So what does he do? He blames me for bringing him the bad news. Mm. His kid brother, huh? Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. mm. You know, I'm a little parched. You mind bringing my beer? Oh, right, yes. I will have the bartender get it. Sorry about that. All uh, right, you know, maybe I'll get some food after all. Oh. I can't believe you ran into my dad again. Yeah, at the police station of all places. But he was cool. Yeah, well, he's trying. Yeah. You know, I was, um, I was going to ask you something. Um, my dad and his wife are renewing their wedding vows tomorrow night, and I was thinking that uh, maybe you'd, you'd want to come. To, to a family thing? Yeah, look, I, I totally understand if you don't want to go. No, 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 no. I mean, I would love to. It means a lot that you'd even ask me. I just want everybody to get to know you, you know, the way I do. Well, thank you. Very much. And I was also thinking that afterwards, maybe um, maybe we could go someplace, you know, to be alone. I like being alone. Yeah. Yeah. But.
but... But what? Um, okay, you have got to promise me something. Oh, well, yeah, anything. I'll promise you anything. Okay. From now on, we are totally upfront with each other about everything. Right, okay? right. I don't care what it is. I do not want any more secrets between us. I won't keep anything from you. Okay, here you go. Thanks. Oh, uh, let me uh, get some of this stuff out of the way for you. Yeah. You know, I got a better idea. Huh. Dump this for me, will you? Oh, you don't want it? I don't need it. Not that cheapskate Dr. Welched. Yeah, yeah, um, I'll take care of it for you. Appreciate it. First time we met. Well, maybe that's because you didn't have any clothes on. <laughs> so that scared you, huh? Yeah, but it doesn't anymore. Hey. Hey. The uh, farm behind the lighthouse is frozen over. Uh, I knew I was bragging about what a good skater you are, so I figured maybe you could show me. You're on. Mm -hmm. But there's uh, there's something I gotta do first, okay? to cover at the recovery room. So, uh, what, do you want to just hitch a ride with me and Jack? I wish. Huh. Allison, what's up? You know how you, uh, convinced yourself that Jack was this, you know, really great guy and you could really trust him and... Could you just get to the point, please? Yeah. I, I met this detective who Chris Ramsey hired and then fired. Um, and he was going to throw away his evidence. Allison! You want the truth, Chris? I used Libby. Is that what you want to hear? I used her to get even with you. That's the truth. That's why I came to Port Uh, what's, what's going on here? Oh, beside you being the biggest jerk on the face of the earth? Allison, Not Allison, lot. I will handle this. Oh. Call me if you need me. Yeah, I promise. You better be nice. Because if you're not, I will make your life miserable. And trust me, I can do it. Well, what's her problem? Well, why don't you hear for yourself? I used Libby. Is that what you want to hear? I used her to get even with you. That's the truth. That's why I came to Port Charles. Jack, I was kind of hoping for an explanation. Yeah, why not? Because it's all true. So they were right. <laughs> you were using me. Libby, when I first met you, I did see you as a way to get back at my brother, but... But, but, that... but, wait a minute. You claimed you didn't even know who your brother was until he saw the photo of the two of you. Uh... Yeah, that was a lie, too, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, it was. So... So you came to town to take something away from him the way he took something away from you, and that something was me? Yeah, that's all true, but so is this. You got to me. I, you changed my life. And, and, and going after Chris, it didn't, wasn't important anymore. You lied to me about everything. You made a fool of me. But that's not what I wanted to do. I Trust I, I, I Go to hell. Okay. You, you got to see that Chris is behind all this. I mean, he's trying to do this to us again. Hey, 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 how do you think you got that tape? Chris hired a private investigator who dumped the evidence. Fortunately, Allison found oh, it. Oh, do you think that was an accident? <sighs> no, I, mean, I bet my life that Chris is behind this, this whole thing. This is not about Chris. This is about you admitting that you were using me. My God. Jack, I was going to go away with you. 
I wanted to make love to you. Libby, please, you gotta hear me. No, no! I'm sick of it. I've heard it a million times already. I already know what you're gonna say, Jack. You can apologize until you drop dead for all I care. I'm done. I'm over it. And I'm over you. Now leave. 